Good afternoon traders. It is Tuesday, January 21st, 2014 and the U.S. stock market is closed. Had kind of a nutty day today. The Dow Jones Industrial Average, believe it or not, actually made an all-time record intraday high this morning right after the open and I thought this was really going to take off and then it just sold off. It sold off fairly significantly and then it came back which is to say we had a pretty sideways market today and our positions were, <laughs> were pretty sideways too. We actually it wasn't a boring day but it was a wash day for us. We uh, we ended up we closed out negative six thousand ninety one dollars. Now you know we brought in losing trades, and today was just kind of one of those. I, I see this all the time. You know, you got negative trades uh, over a long weekend, and they just have a way of not getting any better uh, when you get the open after that weekend, and that's what happened to us. Nothing got really significantly better. We ended up closing out over $6,000 in negative trades. Now, the good news is we're carrying uh, positive $6,600, well, almost $6,700 in open trade equity. So, as I said, it was, uh, you know, we, we made a few hundred dollars, basically uh, a wash day for us. But, you know, this is part of trading and you can't expect to make money day after day after day. You can't expect it always to be exciting. You just got to stick in there. Sooner or later, we're going to have a big day and it could be tomorrow. Anyway, um, I'll, I'll show you the chart. Okay, we're looking at the Dow here and you can see here what happened. Uh, the, the market really took off right at the beginning. And at this point up here, th this was the former all-time high of the market and we actually took that high out on this little spike I think that's about 30 minutes into the day and then it basically fell apart there it came down it got pretty low down here and then it comes back so that really basically translates into a kind of sideways market by the way the Dow officially closed down 44 points today and again, we're just hovering below those uh, record highs and we are going to take those out uh, fairly shortly. In fact, I wouldn't, it wouldn't surprise me if we did it tomorrow because this market just won't go down. A powerful, powerful bull market. Uh, okay, I'll show you a couple trades here. This is in Endeavor Silver e EXK. Nothing spectacular here, but it was, it was a pretty nice trade. We got into this on a breakout on uh, Friday, and today uh, it's kind of interesting. It, it closed down, and it was fairly significantly negative down here, and then this thing really came back hard, and uh, we ended up getting out of here. I mean, you know, we're pretty close to the high there when we got out, and uh, we took. Um, about $1,500 out of uh, Endeavor Silver. And then I'll show you the, the, the real star of the day, which is a open trade with us. This is in BlackBerry, um, BBRY, uh, very uh, heavily traded and heavily speculated market. And on Friday, we, we took the break out about halfway through the day. Uh, it did close positive, but it didn't, you know, it wasn't anything spectacular. Well, this morning, we got the spectacular, this huge gap up. It actually made its high first 15 minutes of the day, and then it pulled back. And I, I was concerned here that this was going to be a fill the gap situation. It just came off that high way too fast for me but it came back and then it came up here and didn't take out the high but it got pretty close to it then it started fading again I thought oh god and then it comes back again so on balance I look at this and I see um, Blackberry is probably gonna go uh, higher quite a bit higher possibly anyway uh, we are holding 
close to seven thousand dollars in that trade in open in open trade so that was our savior for the day and kept us from going in the red anyway I still feel it's a good day even though we didn't make a lot of money I'm looking forward to tomorrow this is trader Bob signing off I will see you tomorrow on Wednesday